Uh, yes, my name is Ron Wade, and uh, I'm uh, asking for venture capital, so I want to go through the spreadsheet that I think will be a global draw. Uh, and first, I want to explain that just through an unusual sort of set of circumstances, trying to figure out something on molecular expansion, I ended up with a perpetual uh, spreadsheet, and it's three columns with a total column. Uh, it runs the numbers out around, uh, around 400. Um, and it says uh, it's pound in UM uh, high apostrophe, uh, which is no more numbers. And the formula continues to run uh, because the video will show that I'm at line 4096 and the formula is intact and it's saying the same thing. So the formula is still running, there just are not numbers uh, for it to insert. So it quickly turns to uh, decimated numbers because you need your your column widths uh, that are required are massive, and and so it builds it builds so quickly, and I don't know how many numbers they have in there, uh, but we would need an infinite supply. Uh, the draw is is through refraction te technology or however we need to do it, we need to let it travel. And the program's going to keep running. In fact, it may actually run, uh, it, it may exceed the expansion of our universe it's so fast. Um, I mean, this is, this is a speed that's going to be gaugeable, and it's, and it's just, I, I think it's instantaneously. And you can imagine what that means. I mean, that, that changes a lot of things. So um, I did a little presentation <clears throat> as well as I could. Uh, looking at a computer screen and of course I don't want to reveal too much uh, but if there was any way to uh, have it go across screens uh, and travel to Oklahoma City uh, it would just it would be incredible it would just that would just be an incredible experience the world has never seen perpetuality and I ended up with it I also have a brand new uh, Albert Einstein, uh, Isaac Newton children's uh, interactive continuity uh, line of clothing uh, because I own the theory of continuity for which I rewrote Isaac Newton's third law uh, because it's actually two equal and opposite reactions, it's not one, and which corresponds with an Albert Einstein little known quote which is two elements in perfect opposition. What that means is they are my intellectual property now uh, because my theory of continuity will not be disproven. So uh, anyway, it helped create this perpetual spreadsheet and it is, it is incredible. It is a new force for man. I, I mean, this is a spreadsheet. It's not supposed to act like this. It's just incredible the way it's acting. It's acting like it's alive. So, okay, uh, hope to hear from you. Thank you. I'm uh, limited on how well you can see it, but you can see we're in line 2006. I'm not going to show you the formula portion, but it's intact. So this is not a copy-paste of that particular uh, notice that no numbers exist. Uh, okay, and uh, let me pause, and I'll take it on up to the beginning. Okay, right here is where it starts to uh, run the numbers out. Uh, you can see. Uh, and then uh, I reset those column widths. I'm not sure why. Okay, now, you know, here when you're, oh, oh, that, I mean, that's why. See, I've run out of column space already. Uh, here, so at this point, my column spaces uh, probably need to be, uh, I, I don't know, uh, with a lot. You get a little further down, and they, they need to be a couple feet. So uh, this is an older version. This is, a, this is one version back, and it only made it to line 128, whereas the version I have now makes it to line 400. But you can see that the formula, it, based on line 4096, the formula kept running. So it was the most incredible thing I've ever seen. And look at how it builds. It's just, it's, uh, it builds symmetrically. And just, you're just going to use billions of numbers. Up. Well, 
it can run to infinity. So uh, we need to kick this off right. I also have a t-shirt line uh, and I also own exclusive rights to use the name Albert Einstein and Isaac Newton and my new clothing line is Einstein-20-Newton. Uh, so anyway, hope to hear from you. Thank you.